Hey you guys, what's up? Welcome to my channel. It is your girl, Spooky Kitty. And today, I'm using my brand new clicker thingy that I got. In my 8-inch um, selfie ring light thingy when I got my new ring light. So, I'm excited because I feel all professional now. Anyways, you guys, um, I have a Dollar Tree haul for you guys. And yeah, I'm also showing off my brand new candle that my little sister gave me. So I went to my little sister's new apartment, which is off the hook. It's insanely luxurious, and I cannot believe my little sister lives there. I'm so proud of her. But she gifted me with this really beautiful sunny lime scented candle from Bath & Body Works. So if you guys follow me on Instagram, you guys will see that I posted a picture of it. But yeah, so just look at a little fancy in the background, a little candle going. And then I also packed a bowl of some Blue Dream that I wanted to share with you guys. Oh yeah, and I got my nails done. Woo! So pretty. In the last video, I think they were like a light baby pink with a, a glitter pink there. I always get glitter in my nails no matter what. I can't just like, I always want to do just like a plain set. But then I'm like, oh shit, I always throw some glitter in there somewhere. But yeah, so I did that. Perfect for springtime. Perfecto. <laughs> so yeah, let's just get right into it. Anyways, the first thing that I got you guys in this Dollar Tree haul, finally after six minutes in, is these coconut facial wipes with eucalyptus. And I just love the packaging. It's cute. Super cute. And these are from the brand Bolero. I know these are like super, super old already. People have been hauling these for like uh, at least a month or something now, maybe longer. But dude, I, I seriously have not hauled all my Dollar Tree stuff yet. So yeah. Let me just do that for you guys so I can just get it over with. <clears throat> get it over with and then like start posting new shit. Anyway, these are grapefruit and lime moisturizing mo bleh, moisturizing facial wipes. Why did that not want to come out right? I just like the little cute limes on here. These are so cute. And I think I gave my sister um, a package of these and hers was lavender and honey pretty sure that's the one that I gave her and I think that's it for the facial wipes oh no here it is another one this one's wild jasmine and jojoba or do you did I say that right jojoba or is it jojoba jojoba <laughs> I don't know whatever but yeah and these all come with uh this one comes with 32 yeah they all come with 32 wipes in each package so that's kind of cool these all look really nice perfect for you know, summertime or whatever, spring. These are cute in like a little beach bag. So, cool beans. Cool beans, bruh. Um, I picked these up from Crafters Square. These are just really cool. I like this uh, truck, this yellow truck with this black and white canopy. It reminds me of a little flower shop. Well, I think that's what the aesthetic is going for. It's like a little flower shop. So stinking cute. I love that. How fun would it be to like own your own flower shop, right? <clears throat> and you'd just be living a little Hallmark life. So adorable. And then I picked up these cool paper plates and they just kind of give me like fairy vibes. I don't know why. Probably because it's just like really like Shakespeare-y with like the letter, the um, cursive in the background, the little post-it no it's all like I don't know it just gives me like oh shit look there's an Eiffel Tower it's a butterfly an Eiffel Tower I don't know what Mason Blanc means but I'm sure it means something really pretty and then what else does it say 24 Rue Marie Paris dinners lunches I got something in my nose it's like tickling me hold on all right, whatever it is was in my nose. I just like try to get it out. Okay. Anyways, there wasn't anything in my nose. It was just tickling. <laughs> so these come in a count of 18 paper plates. Super cute for like a springtime picnic. I love that. I love the vibes. All right, and then um, check this out. Every time I see good movies at the Dollar Tree, I just get them because I have a huge DVD collection already. So this one's Big Top Scooby-Doo, and I'm a huge Scooby-Doo fan, so 
I love to add any um, Scooby-Doo movies that I don't have. I like to add them to my collection. And I think this one is where they visit, like, the circus and stuff. So, yeah. I was like, ooh, I don't have that one. I'm going to grab that for a dollar. It's mine. And then The Littlest Pet Shop is honestly one of my favorite cartoons ever. Um, yeah. So, my son will, like, occasionally watch me. Watch me. He'll catch me watching The Littlest Pet Shop. He'll, like, come out of his room, and he's like, what are you watching? I'm like, The Littlest Pet Shop. He's like, why? <laughs> like, because I like it. I love this cartoon. Oh, my goodness. Now I'm going to sneeze. Are you kidding me? So when I was younger, when The Littlest Pet Shop came out, I was, like, a teenager, so, like, I didn't really play with these toys, but my sisters had these toys, and they had, like, everything. Every single little pet you could think of, they had such a huge collection. And they had all the little jungle gems for it, like the little playgrounds and all that cool stuff. And, oh, excuse me, I'm going to sneeze. <coughs> excuse me. Ugh. Yeah, but my sisters had, like, the whole entire setup for the Littlest Pet Shop. It was really cute. And now that I'm an adult, I'm like, man, I wonder how, um, how much all those, like, toys are worth now. I'm sure they're not worth a lot, but they're still really cool. Why am I so sneezy? <coughs> oh my goodness. I'm sneezing over here, bruh. I'm like, sorry. I don't have anything on me. I'm just wiping, but yeah, sorry. I know it probably looks gross. next thing that I want to show you guys um let me see what else did I get in here oh yeah I'll show these to you guys all right and then the next thing I wanted to show you guys are these cleansing wipes that I got from Bolero as well I got three of them because these were the ones that I liked the packaging the most it was raspberry uh raspberry and fresh mint so cool. These are kind of remind me of like a 70s vintage kind of like theme. I don't know why they give me like 70s vintage vibes. I feel like this is the kind of wallpaper you would like see like back in the 70s for sure. And then this one is lavender and coconut oil. And this is really pretty. It's got some island vibes. <clears throat> Cute little island vibes. And then this one is sweet orange and jojoba again, or jojoba. I don't know how to say that. <laughs> so, yeah. So cute. I haven't used any of these ones yet. Um, but, yeah. I still have to go through my other ones first. But um, these ones come with 30 in each package. So, 30 count in these ones. And then these ones have 32. So, honestly, they're all such a great, such a great steal. These are perfect. And I love how cute the packaging is. Like, I can just imagine these, like, in a quick little, throw these in your purse really quick and just go to, like, the park, picnic, or whatever you're doing for the day. Just throw those in there. Sorry if you hear the neighbor. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry if you guys hear my neighbors. They're like outside yelling. So sorry if you guys can hear the neighbors. Yeah. I don't know if you can, but if you can, sorry. I just, like, I have my back door cracked open to, like, air out all the smoke. And they were just yelling outside. So I don't know. We gotta be... <laughs> okay you guys um the next thing that I got because I've been feeling like really like I want to set do like my own like art setup in my apartment I want to like start like just buying because I already have all kinds of arts and craft shit I just need to start organizing it and I bought all this stuff 
so in the hopes that I'll start like building my little art setup, you know. Anyway, here we go. So, <coughs> what was that? Like, my voice was all so. <laughs> that was weird. Okay, so these are from the brand Rich Art since 1926. Art, uh, what's, how do you say that? Acrylogy? Yeah, I think so. Acrylogy. This is the color light green. This is lavender. Ooh, look, it matches my nails. That's so pretty. I love that. Lavender and this color green are honestly my one of my favorite color combos. Perfect for spring. I know I've said that a couple times, maybe. Perfect for spring. But yeah, seriously, light green and lavender. And these are just premium acrylic paint. And it says that they're multi-purpose, safe and non-toxic, and water-soluble. So yeah, and then this is in the color vermilion. Kind of looks like an orangish red. But I had to get that too. And then I got um, magenta. So pretty. Oh, yeah. And then I got black. Just regular black. And I picked the black one up because um, I think I'm going to add these two together and do a jack-o'-lantern with this color. And then I'm going to do, like, a beautiful black um, background and then put, like, some stars or something. Maybe if I can find this in a yellow, I'll pick a yellow up, too, because... I'll have to get yellow for, like, the moon and stars. So I did not get any big canvases, but I did find this little small one. It's a 4 by 6 inch, and it came with three of them. And they're just natural canvases. They're excellent for oil and acrylic paints, it says. And this is also from the brand Quaft uh, Quafter. Quafter Square. <laughs> Crafter Square. <laughs> And then I grabbed one of these little thingies. It's um, an artist palette. So yeah, I just grabbed one of these so I can like put all the paint in each one of these little thingies and kind of like take it back to elementary school style. Actually, I don't even remember if we had these in elementary or not, but they're so cute. I don't know, like what's this for? Like what is this also for paint? I don't know. Just curious if anybody knows what that's for let me know Picasso baby so anyway look I got some paint brushes three pieces oh I look like crap right now I just saw myself I'm like ew here's the three piece brush set master stroke there's a shader a round one and another shader so these are pretty cool from crafter square they look really fancy too well kind of fancy and then I also got these ones. It's a five-piece art brushes, small, medium, and large brushes, it says. And I like how they're like a forest green. It's a pretty mm -hmm. color. These other ones are like navy blue. But yeah. And then did I get anything else for like my arts and crafts stuff? Let me see. Mm, I guess you could kind of, yeah. You could. We can throw these in my arts and crafts stuff. They're just mini glass containers, and these are really cute because you could fill them with, like, glitter or little messages, and you can just like, make little fairy bottles. I think these are cute. So I think I'm going to make, like, do a DIY project and, like, make my own little fairy DIY and kind of, like, give these to, like, my friends or, like, I don't know. I just feel like maybe these would even be cute to, like, hide around and then like random people can just find them and think that they found actual messages from fairies what is wrong with me just kidding i honestly would love to do that but that sounds like something i would have done when i was like 15 and i was high on acid because <laughs> i actually remember like story time when i was 15 years old i literally got super 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 duper like out there and then I um me and my friends we were like tripping on acid and I remember we hid gummy bears all over my apartment randomly like in the most random places and then like months later when I wasn't tripping <clears throat> anymore I remember I was like cleaning and I remember just like finding random gummy bears all over my apartment like throughout you know the rest of the time that we lived there and I'd be like oh my god like this is so funny like haha 
And it would just remind me of that time that I tripped and hid all those gummy bears. But yeah. Don't do that because you might get ants all over your place. Not that we did, but you never know. You never know. I'm like, don't hide gummy bears in your apartment because you might get ants. Like, I never even was like, don't do acid because it's bad for your brain. <laughs> yeah, don't do acid either. Um, it's crazy, yeah. It was crazy. If you guys want to know what, like, my ass, what I did when I was on acid, like, let me know in the comments below. And maybe I'll do, like, a story time video on, like, the time that I tripped on acid when I was 15. So, yeah. <clears throat> that could be actually a really good video. Or maybe TMI. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Okay, the next things that I got, you guys, are pretty much all, like, just beauty stuff. Yeah. So, here we go. So this is the watermelon scented hand cream. Super cute. It's got a little mermaid on it. Well, a mermaid tail, actually. I love the packaging. It's got the little bubbles. Maybe I need to dim this light. I think my light might be too bright. Might be too bright. Is that chill? I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I'm supposed to bring the light down. Let me see. Whoa. Did that work? Is that crazy? I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing, you guys. I don't know. Let's fix this. Don't mind my patio. My bike and my boyfriend's swim trunks hanging out there because when we went swimming, you gotta hang the swim trunks somewhere. Hang them on the patio. That's what I say. Alright, I think that's cool. We'll just leave it. We'll just quit fucking around. Alright. I've already showed this for like 10 million years. I got some Oreo lip flavored lip balm because my boyfriend loves Oreos and I was like, he's gonna love this. But I showed it to him and he was like, really? I was like, wow. He thought I was cool. So anyway, these are so stinking cute. They're just like two little headbands. Two little pom-pom headbands and they come separately like that and what I'm gonna do is put my hair in two little piggy tails <clears throat> and I'm gonna have like schoolgirl piggy tails and it's gonna be a Y2K look a really cute I'm like wow what are you doing girl what are you doing right now boom boom done done and done all right so <clears throat> I got these nail polishes which I don't ever use because I always go and get my nails done so I don't know why I keep fucking buying nail polish but you know it's what we do this one is in party time party time and it kind of reminds me of like um it reminds me of like New Year's Eve colors like Christmas colors New Year's Eve because it's got the gold green and the red in there super pretty super cute and then this one is called going out and this one is so pretty too. It's almost like a space color, like cyberspace. It's like a dark glitter, out, outer space galaxies. I don't know if you can see that, but it, this would look really pretty with this green that I have going right now, like so cute. Okay, and then this one is called VIP Vibes Baby. Cause you know, we only chill in the VIP. All right, that is so cute. And this one is like a, beautiful watermelon color it's perfect with these green nails Ugh. I don't know how to do the lighting just yet but I will get it down and I will master this lighting so that way next time it doesn't look so crappy but yeah I'm trying to show you guys the pink and I just don't think that you can see it that well because the lighting is too effing bright let me see what's up I'm just gonna play with the lights hold on <clears throat> dim that shit Ooh brain that shit Ooh. is that too bright maybe that's where it's supposed to be it's supposed to be bright bitch okay we'll leave it bright then this is i got the juice and this is by wet and wild and it's a gel lip liner this is a gel lip liner in the shade 
I got the juice. I got the juice, baby. All right. <clears throat> Ooh, last nail polish that was hiding in the bag, trying to get thrown away. It's called Sunnies On. Put your Sunnies on. Speaking of Sunnies, that's what I'm going to show you guys next. I bought this nail polish and didn't even realize that days later I was going to actually get my nails done in the same color. Well, it's not the same exact color, but it's like similar. So like the color that I have going on is like really, really light pastel -y, neon -y. I don't I, this would not be pastel -y. it's definitely not showing up the color that it is I don't know because the lights are so freaking bright baby 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 you guys I'm so annoying right now I'm annoying myself I have a couple more things to show you guys and then I'm done so these I can't believe I found these at the Dollar Tree for a dollar a dollar Yes, you heard it right, baby. A dollar. Wow. They're polycarbonate lenses and they're ultraviolet protection. So that's pretty chill. And I love these and I cannot wait to wear them. <clears throat> um, and I grabbed two more pairs of glasses. Oh, shit. This one's all scratched up in my bag. I should have took these out of these bags much, much sooner. I'm an asshole. Oh well. Look at these, you guys. These are giving me like psychobilly, psychobilly vibes, like bad girl in the late 1950s. Like, I just need a little cherry skirt or a poodle skirt with cherries on it. That's what I meant to say. So the next pair that I got are literally the exact same vibe, except they are a white frame. These are cool, dude. These are giving me Barbie vibes. Oh, my dogs. My dogs. They're just like... Rawr, 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 rawr. They bark at everything, so yeah. They're barking because somebody opened the door. My man, he's opening doors. Do we like these? Do we like these? These are like super cool 1950s Barbie vibes. I don't know where I'm going to wear these, but summertime's coming, so maybe... Maybe we'll find somewhere to wear these. Cute. I'm annoying, you guys. I know. All right. Um, oh, check these out. See, like, I bought this stuff so long ago, I kind of forget that I had this stuff. Oopsie. Oopsie. All right, so look at this. Tea tree night lotion and tea tree... Just oil. Tea tree oil and tea tree night lotion. Ideal for blemished skin so cute and this is cool because check out the pump that it came with it like came with a cute little for a dollar this packaging is really really like upscale for a zoala and then this right here oh oh the bong i don't care about anything else but the bong <clears throat> i like how they just put it in like one of those old timey um like old school jars that's like dark to keep the oil fresh you know how they do it whatever i'm gonna open this real quick just to smell it tea tree oil is really strong and you should be very very careful with this stuff because if you accidentally spill it you're effed you are fucked you are fucked forever because that smell ain't coming off a of shit hmm. okay it's the smells in there but i'm not going to shake it and get a spill that's what it wants me to do that's what fucking wants me to do oh my god i better stop cussing huh okay so let me set those aside and then the next thing that i got is this magnet it says bloom there it is bloom there it is shaka, 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 shaka. <laughs> so cute it reminded me of that commercial where the mom and the dad are like <laughs> i was like yes I need this on my fridge okay and then I picked up these like really really cute um I don't know it says junior yum yums lip gloss from the yo-yo from yo-yo world and this one's chocolate ice cream flavor Ooh, that's so cute that packaging though I see these at the Dollar Tree all the time but I just never grabbed them but I was like I'm gonna grab one of these this time because it's so cute 
six years and up it says and guess what you guys not only did I get this one in the flavor chocolate ice cream but I grabbed two of these and I'm pretty sure these are like mystery packages so you can like open it up and get like a mystery inside of it and it says collect all five so I only bought two but if I like it maybe I'll buy more I don't know it says you can collect strawberry chocolate strawberry ice cream oh wait that's dumb there's two strawberry ice creams why would you want to collect two strawberry ice creams just kidding so they have grape ice cream flavor cotton candy ice cream flavor yeah so I'm gonna go ahead and open these bad boys right now the suspense is real are you ready who do you think you got I want Cotton candy, no doubt. Cotton candy and I guess strawberry ice cream. Or I don't want I don't want the chocolate ice cream flavor, but it has a unicorn on it. So maybe we'll see. We'll see. Okay. Fingers crossed that I get the cotton candy though for real. Come on. So excited. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Who is this? Oh, how cute! Okay, so it's not what I wanted. It's holographic gloss in the flavor grape. Oh my god, that is so stinking cute. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Cute. So stinking cute. I wish I could like zoom in and show you guys, but my camera has to be facing the opposite way. Whatever. Let me smell this. Ooh. Grapes. Grapes and grapes and grapes and grapes. And it's orange, though. That's weird. Can you guys see that? It's orange. But it's grape. Nah, that ain't right. Let's see what the next one is. Yeah, yeah. Okay. They're kind of hard to open. It kind of hurt my teeth. Oh my god. And now I'm a fucking... I'm not going to break a nail on this shit, bitch. I'm not breaking a nail on this, bitch. Sorry. Sorry. There we go. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? The same fucking one. I am livid right now. I want my fucking money back. Just a second ago, I was happy. Now... It's beyond me. I cannot tell you how angry I am that I got doubles. I don't like that unless they're fire. But, oops. I think I need to take a rip for my bong. That is just disappointing. I didn't even get cotton candy. Like, I was really hoping for cotton candy. What do you do? When those are your biggest problems, I guess life is okay. <laughs> Amen to that. Amen to that. Ooh, ooh. All right, last things, you guys. And I am out of here. <coughs> Let's hide my cough face. All right, last thing that I want to show you guys are from the brand Beauty Guru. It's just the Natural Bright Skin Syrup. Syrup? Skin Syrup. Don't put syrup on your face. <laughs> Natural Bright Skin Serum with Rosehip Oil. And it says that um, Bright Skin Syrup. Oh my god. <laughs> bright Skin Serum with Rosehip Oil is traditionally known for jojoba emo, emollient. Is that how you say that? Emollient? Rose hip skin brightening, carrot seed for balancing, turmeric for antioxidants, sandalwood anti aging, geranium skin tightening, lang lang soothing, and coconut oil moisturizing. 100% natural. So I know you can't see that on the side, but this is really cool. I can't wait to start using that. And then this one is Natural Eyelash Enhance Serum with castor oil so that's cool 
um, I'm assuming it says traditionally known for a castor, which is hair follicle and rosemary for nourishing. So this is supposed to like nourish your eyelashes <clears throat> and it's supposed to be like some sort of serum to make your eyelashes like enhanced, longer, fuller, voluptuous, hopefully. All right, and then the last thing is the natural under eye serum with sea buckthorn with a roll on applicator. Beauty Guru. Um, I think they're a great brand, actually. I don't, I haven't used all of their products, but I do like their packaging and I like that they're a dollar. So, yeah. It says the under eye serum with the sea buckthorn is traditionally known for rose hip which is good for skin brightening, camellia, which is good for antioxidants, <clears throat> sea buckthorn, reviving coffee, CO2, skin tightening, lemon, <clears throat> astringent, frank frankincense, astringent, coconut oil, moisturizing. Okay. Oh, yeah, and then these, dude. Totally, I'm forgetting these prayer cards. Boom. I got these prayer cards from the Dollar Tree, and I can't believe... Look at... I don't know if you can see that. It's, like, golden, shining like it's from heaven. These are really cute prayer cards, dude. Like, you could easily put these in... Um, these are big size, and it comes with 20 cards in each package. I like how each card... Or each package is extremely different. Like, not extremely different, but, like, they are different. <clears throat> I think these are really cute because, like... You could give these as a gift to someone for Mother's Day or a birthday. If they're really religious, if they're not, give them something else. Excuse me, I'm like burping. Like silent burps. But no, seriously, like, or even if you're spiritual, like, I'm not su super, super religious. I'm super spiritual, but I still like, I, I still like, I still wanted these cards, though. Today's prayer, it says. Today's prayer. And then you just flip it. Boom. It's got, like, mad prayers on it. Like, look at that. Look how many cards. Mad prayers. Oh, I love, I love, I love. So, let's just pull a random prayer, okay? And this prayer that I'm going to pull is for everybody reading this. So, if this prayer hits you, please like the like button. If it's, like, something you're like, bean, that message was for me. All right. Today's prayer card. It says, ah, doggy toy. Oops. Okay. I will instruct you and teach you in the way you should go. I will counsel you. I will counsel you and watch over you, says the Lord. Yeah. <laughs> that one was okay. Let's try another one. I will instruct you and teach you in the way you should go. I will counsel you and... I, it sounds like I'm saying cancel you. I will cancel you. I will cancel. Cancel. Cancel you and watch over you, says the Lord. That's a good one, though. But for reals, but I want to just, like, I just want a different one, okay? The eyes of the Lord are on those who fear him. On those whose hope is in his unfailing love. See, these are kind of <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I might edit this part out. Anyways, guys, thank you so very much with all my heart and soul. Nah, seriously, though, you guys, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you guys like today's video, please give it a thumbs up. In the next video, I'm going to be doing my hair and makeup, and I'm going to look like an actual girl. So, yeah, look forward to that. And then um, I'll also be doing my Wake and Bake Wednesday coming this Wednesday, so be looking forward to that. I know I... Said I was going to be doing it last Wednesday, but I never did. So, yeah. But anyways, guys, thank you guys so much for watching today's video. If you guys liked it, please give it a thumbs up. If you guys liked my nails, just give the video a thumbs up. Just for the nails, okay? And, yeah, we're going to go ahead and just sign off with these cool glasses. Ooh, ow, tag in the eye. Tag in the eye. Oh, All right, guys. Put all this stuff away.